former professional athlete, once made a statement that caught dot my attention. He said, Anyone can be a father, but it takes someone special to be a dad, and that's why I call you dad, because you are so special to me. There is also a common saying that a father carries pictures where his money used to be. The love he possesses for his own is comparable to nothing. I remember some years back when I was still a little, the first time I saw my dad cry. My little brother was seriously ill and it was funny to hear a rather sturdy looking man screaming, stay with me. I can't eat the chocolate bar all by myself. He melted before my very eyes. Fathers are priceless. Yes, and as much as we celebrate mothers, we ought to celebrate our fathers too. It is understandable that most of us naturally snuggle up to our moms. We lived in them as fetuses, suckled on them as infants and became even more bonded to them as we grew up. Dads stand to protect, defend and provide for their families. Nevertheless, as a saying goes, My father gave me the greatest gift anyone could give another person, he believed in me. Do you remember standing with him on the shore of the beach, his figure towering over you? Do you remember how he used to toss you in the air and caught you midway before you reached the ground? He left work to be there at your graduation. I could go on and on about the relevance and warmness of our fathers. Do you not think we should celebrate them? The idea of Father's Day celebration was inspired first, by the Mother's Day tradition, which began in the 20th century. In 1908, a memorial service was held for a large number of men who died in a mining accident in Monongah, West Virginia. Most of them that died were fathers. This event could also be one of the reasons for Father's Day. The most prominent name in getting Father's Day recognized is a woman Sonora Dodd. When she was little, her mother died. Widowers then often remarried immediately or left their kids in the care of someone else. Her father did otherwise. He raised his six kids all by himself. Years later, Sonora felt that her father deserved recognition for what he did. Anna Jarvis's success in pushing for the establishment of Mother's Day celebrations inspired her. Due to her consistency, the first Father's Day celebration held on June 1910. President Nixon officially recognized Father's Day as a holiday in 1972. Ever since then, the world has grown to appreciate the role of fathers and their contributions in the lives of their children and the society. Different families have different range of traditions for the celebration of this memorable event. Some simply buy gifts or give cards while others throw large parties in celebrating all the father figures in the family especially in extended families. On this day, however, there are no restrictions to normal activities. Stores, public transport transits and other organizations go about their schedule for that day. Restaurants though, tend to be a little busier than usual as many people often take their fathers out for a treat. The rigidity that many fathers display is born out pure love. As kids, we have to understand that more often than not, our fathers are wiser than we are. They understand the implications of our youthful exuberances and that it may lead to complicated situations that we as teenagers or young adults do not see. All they have ever tried to do is keep us off harm's way. Father's Day speech or paragraph from a wife, for her husband. Also as wives, we have to understand what our husbands go through to fend for us and to protect us. Shuffling between work making out time to attend to the family needs and having time for satisfying a wife's personal needs are rigorous activities. There is a proverb that goes thus, to be a man is not a day's job and that holds true in every sense of the word. My point is, fathers and father figures all over the world have done so much to put smiles on the faces of their kids and wives and families as a whole. As much as they have done this, let us always do our best to put a smile back on their faces. We should not wait till it is Father's Day to show them the love, care, and attention that they deserve but we should make every Father's Day celebration a memorable one for them. Thanks for your time.